Spider-Man. Spidey Fun, get ready for an epic Spider-Man video. Hi, Spider friends, it's your friendly neighborhood dog, my Spider-Man fan here. Back with his next um, collection video vlog. And this is number 60. And this is going to be possibly my final collection video vlog, up, uh, collection update vlog. Because after this, it's going to possibly be, well, it's going to be right, right back to my other versions, where the scene skips to the next one. About, yeah, the, well, yesterday before this, so I'll be back to normal after this, after this collection video vlog. So, let's get ready. So, right, ultimate, right, so first I'm going to go for Ultimate Spider-Man in here. And then I've got my angles down here. Also, Spider Bros, I actually I will say that um, besides the stories in Ultimate Spider Man, I actually do love the front covers way more than the actual comic strip. Because I, I really do like the art on the um, front covers um, until maybe later on. Until maybe um, the art changes after 70 or 80, maybe before. But I do like, uh, well, from basically number one to maybe 40 or 50. But I do like well. It's a really cool style art. It's a really cool style art. I like the art way more, way better than the actual comic strip. But I do love this comic strip more. Well, I love the com. I really do love the comic strips on them. But I do like the art on the front more. But yeah. And yes, I actually did. As I actually showed on screen, after I said that about the annuals, I got the images. Well, some of them because like I got images from annual um, like. Annual 1977, which I found on eBay at one point years ago, when I just thought I'd get it because of the fact that I uh, just wanted to see what uh, just wanted to see what comic strip was on. So two thousand, I've got two thousand and three, all the way up to twenty nineteen. But after two thousand and twelve, I think it was, or just after, um, it was just the spectacular Spider Man Adventures comic strips in them. So I'm not gonna put them in because they're just from my other ones. Which I actually grew up, grew up getting. So, right, Ultima Spider-Man, right. I've got, right, let's see, all overall, I've got Ultima Spider-Man 1, all through to 160, which is actually the, the um, heartbreaking comic, comic strip of Spar uh, the death of Spider-Man. But, Ultima Spider-Man, okay. 1, right, Ultima Spider-Man 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, tw twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, and thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, and thirty-nine, and then issue one and a half. Which is actually which actually ends the omnibus ends the omnibus, and then with these ones, well, go and do it this way. Right. Oh, just mind them. We can't even go and see it. Okay. Well, it's basically f right. 40, 40, 41, 42, 43, 45, uh, all the way up to basically eighty five. So 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, and 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, and 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, and 85. Then, after that, it doesn't end there, just to say. Just get that back in there. Right. Then I've got. Then I've got this. The Death of Spider Man graphic novel, which starts off with 153 all the way to. 153 all the way to 160. So 153, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59. And one hundred and sixty. Cool, 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 cool. Right. Now on to the annuals. So, okay. 
Let's see. Now you're gonna see this. You are gonna see the co uh, the covers here. So, on your 1977. So, uh, right. Okay. So this is called the Yesterday Connection. I have Spider Man and the Punisher on. Um, let's see. Um, Spidey meets Dark Savage. Spider Man and the Punisher. And yeah. So that's that one. That's that one. Right. Annual two thousand and three. Three three D cover. Just a bit. Just a say. Cool. Right and this is Peter Parker, the Peter Parker Spider Man. Okay, Days of Our Lives. I couldn't find the cover to the date, which is actually in here. It says the date. And then Police Story. Got that. I think I'm wrong. Look at these upside down for now. Oh, yeah, I'll show you the back of that too. Peter Parker, Spider Man, A Day in the Life, w One Night Only, and then Snow Day. Peter Parker, Spider Man, Snow Day. Okay. Uh, okay. Annual 2005. Oh, yeah, I'll show you the back of that. Actually, I don't even think I showed you the front though. Sorry about that. And then I'll show you the back of this too. Awesome. Okay. Uh, let's see. Green Death beneath the desert, which is green. Is it? Hang on over right here. Yeah, which is basically based off the Green Goblin's first appearance, where the Green Goblin and the Enforcers jump, jump Spider Man after getting him to agree to um, go on um, a movie studio. Which I've already got in my omnibus and just passed the Green Goblin's first appearance, issue 14. So let's see. Hunter and Hunter. I don't think I've got that one. It's to do with Daredevil and a circus with the uh, the Ringmaster. So I don't think I've got that one, but I've got those anyway. Hold And uh, this, okay, okay, the the return of the vulture, and this is actually from Marvel Age. There's um there's ones here from Marvel Age and and uh, Marvel Adventures, which is basically kids books. And something just popped up on my screen, and I can't see it. Okay, okay, uh, to stop to stop the sound, Marvel Marvel Age. Okay, on that. Annual 2007. Love that picture. Alright, okay. Marked for destruction by Dr. Doom. And that's Marvel, Marvel Age, I think. Uh, let's see. The, 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 the uh, quote spe uh, the quotes for the something adventure of the Green Goblin, which is Marvel Age. Or Marvel Adventures. I don't know. I forget which one it is. So yeah. That's all. Nearly done here Spidey Bruce. Nearly done. Okay. I will say I do have annual 2008. But that's a Spider-Man 3 annual 2008. Um, plus before I go here. I'm glad you want to show you some of the books I actually have towards the wall here. Next time. Oh I. Right. So that's is Well okay that. Then the back of it. Love it. Okay. Okay. Reptile. And w World War G. And. Uh, uh, yeah, that's it. That's wor World War G. Okay, so that's to do with the Green Goblin and Hobgoblin, I think. So yeah, that's that one. I'm nearly done here. 2010. Actually, I might recognize some of these arts from my art collection. 
which I'll well if you go into my um my um co the comment section below, you'll see that I've got the entire um playlist including my um pocketbook my uh, my pocketbook collection my comic book collection links are down there, so you can see my other comic book collections plus my entire collection video playlist, which you'll which you'll see on my art as well. So. Okay. Hi, I've okay. Sp sp okay, sp sorry. Uh, okay, I spider my alert to, to stop worrying, worrying, and love the arms. Okay? The black cat? Wait a minute. So, yeah, the, the uh, black cat. Which is Marvel Adventures, I think. So, yeah, that's that one. And the last one, this is the, this is the one that I actually won. After I sent an image in to Spectacular Spider Man, and I won this because my picture was printed. Right, okay. No, I actually want to say this is actually pretty weird. Spider Man Power, power Struggle. This, right. Electro is the main villain villain in this comic strip, but Sandman is on the front cover. Unless that's unless it's unless it's the wrong cover, but I don't think it is. That's weird to me. And then the Vulture Hunt, which is the which is to do with Craven on the Vulture. And yeah, that's it. Now one minute. Well, I'm gonna try Annual Two Thousand and Twelve, just to see what this one is. I might have the comic strip on this, I'm just looking. Okay. Yeah, I do. I do. Yes, that's it. Damn it. Okay, um, so yeah, that's it for the uh, annuals. <laughs> and, okay. I'll just, I'll just, I'll leave, okay, I'll do this, and then move these over here for me, so. I'll fix them all off camera, spy Bruce. Okay, so over here, actually I might grab the camera. I actually might grab the, I actually might grab the camera, actually. Right, I don't. Right, hold on. In here, I've got the um, movie movie books just behind just behind there. So if you can't see that too well, I was like, "Hello, I'm gonna switch the camera around, Spider Bruce." Okay, Spider Bruce. So um, basically, back here, I've got the um, the movie storybooks, Spider Man one, two, and three. Then in here, there are actually we met many stories of Spider Man. Like there, these books are made for, in my opinion, maybe two year olds, but I still got them anyway. I got I got four for the price of one one time. And then, um, let's see, in here, right now, hang on, in here, I've actually got, hang on, if I can get this up, Spider Bruce, right, The Amazing Spider Man 1, the movie storybook, and The Amazing Spider Man 2 storybook. So, yeah, got them back here. I've got Spider Man Homecoming back here with uh, that Spider Man. Uh, Spider Man Homecoming, the mega movie storybook down here. Then I've got the Amazing Spider Man Annual 11 2008 right here. So the, the, the one with Jackpot, the Jackpot Secrets Revealed. So, yeah, that. And then down here, I've got Venom. Oh. 
the Sinister Spider-Man Phantom. And then I've got Phantom Dark Origin down there. I will say I don't really read those that much. And then Marvel's The Remastered Edition by Kirk Buskell and Alex Ross. Sorry if I said that Buskell, um, were wrong. B -b -b Kurt, B Kurt Bus Busiek, or whatever. And then I've got. Got that. Too many adventures of Spider Man and Iron Man. And then I've got the PlayStation magazine with Insomniac's Marvel Spider Man on it. So yeah. So yes, my boys, I'm gonna have to fix a wee bit of this off camera. So, yeah, other than that, so yeah, that's um, all of my Spider-Man books. Like I said, I've got way more than even I thought. But yeah, other than that, Spy Boos, um, I don't know, I might switch the camera and go around. So yeah, Spy Boos, that's going to be it for this um, collection video vlog and series of, my, and series of um, collection videos in my vlog. So after this, my vlog 61. We'll be, right, we'll be right back to the way it was with all sorts of different bits of footage. AKA okay, probably me reading my books, playing a Spider Man PS4. Um, and my, um, well, I don't know if I'll go in, I don't know if it'll be in my cinema room. But um yeah, reading my books, drawing even, because I still have to actually finish so, uh, my iPad actually said on drawing and I still need to finish. But uh yeah, we're right back to the way it was before um, vlog fifty. So um yeah, other than that, so thank you incredibly so much for uh, thank you incredibly so much for being here to watch my updated collection of video vlogs, which in my opinion these were better because I actually showed you the exact front covers instead of um, just the front covers of the actual book I have. You saw a lot more issues I have in my room, in in this series of collection video vlogs. So yeah, um, yeah, comment below what you think. So yeah. Um, yeah, I'll see all you spy bros as always in all of my next epic spy videos and vlogs. And again, just in case, just in case it's actually announced during the summer, I've seen some rumors saying it could be released late summer, like in August or whatever. But stay tuned for my reaction to Insomniac's Marvel Spider Man 2 for PS5. Because I'll be doing a reaction to that, and I'm seriously, seriously hoping it's shown. And literally, I am literally getting super hyped already. And you know, as soon as I see that trailer and, po and possible release date, 2021 or whatever, yeah, my hype for it is going to explode, I bet you. So yeah, other than that, yeah, I'll see all you spy bros as always in all of my next epic spy videos and my vlogs. It's your friendly neighborhood. The ultimate spy fan, over and out. <laughs>